welcome back to Frosty Eye Candy. So, the usual, we know the pillow paint, we know the pouring medium, and you know the cell activator we're using. I'm just going to run through the colours for you before we get into the voiceover double time video. So, first off, we are going to be using this one. It's Twilight by this little piggy. Absolutely beautiful red pinkish colour and has a blue, blue flash to it, I believe, in the light. Absolutely beautiful colour. That's Twilight. Now, next in the lineup, the usual favourites, the usual suspects, Prism Violet <laughs> by Liquitex. This is the uh, Goo Wash. Thank you very much, Randy. And uh, yes, it is semi opaque, as you can tell by the little square that's half filled in. Next, we're going to be using another one of my serious favourites. Oh, they all are. This little piggy, and this one is Golden Peach. Absolutely fantastically beautiful light pink colour with this golden sheen to it that's just, oh, wow. You know, when you buy it, order two. <laughs> Next, it's going to be something we haven't used for a while, but back to the Liquitex. Uh, this is the soft body acrylic Quinacridone Crimson, and this one is transparent, as we can see, by the little empty square. And the last but not least, and we're not putting these down in order, you'll see the order that I'm actually putting them down in, guys, when we get to the piece. Last one, Twinkle by This Little Piggy. Absolutely fantastic uh, um, blue slash violet interference colour. One way it looks blue, one way it looks violet. Uh, absolutely gorgeous. And that's Little Twinkle. And if you're wondering where to get the piggies, the address has been up all the time, and you can go to that website and order away and order yourself an amazing drove. Anyway, zip, zip, zip. That's it, Frosty. That's enough talking. I'm gonna get the camera pointing down and we're gonna get on with painting. Okay, so the first color we're putting down here, friends, is the Prism Violet. This is the Gouache. Thank you very much for that one, Wendy. And uh, just bear with me while I scrape the last of this pot out because we want this as a nice solid background for our center swipe. Next, I'm putting down, this is TLP, this little piggy. This is the golden peach. And as you can see, I'm being very generous with it. I just can't help myself. Next, this is the quinacridone magenta. This, that's the soft body acrylic by Liquitex. And now we're laying down stripes of this little piggy and this one's twilight, either side. And as you might have guessed, friends, we're going to be doing one center swipe through the middle, then one swipe up and one swipe down. So next I'm putting down, this is the, this little piggy and this one's Twinkle, the Interference Blue Violet. And just as, just as with the Golden Peach, I can't help myself <laughs> and I possibly overdo it. I'm sure lots of you will, uh, will be able to Sympathise with me, friends. Now I'm putting down a little bit more golden peach because I didn't think there was enough. Wow, really going overboard with it. <laughs> so now we're going to go in for the centre swipe. You can see I've loaded up my swiping tool with Prussian blue activator and I've put some titanium white activator on it as well and as you can see not quite enough Prussian blue so I'm going to put a little more on the end of my tool and swipe out these last colors perfect I know I say it every time guys but watching the cells develop double quickly is mesmerizing for me now we're going in with the titanium white cell activator Just loving watching those cells pop up. Going in for the other side, you can see how much I loaded on the swiping tool. Now we're gonna get ready for the modification, but first, I just like to swipe out the two corners of color on the bottom here, just in case they still remain on the canvas after we spin it out. And there's the last one at the top, just about to go. Cheerio. So now we're ready for the modification, guys. 
we'll go down to regular speed and stay with a close up so you can see what I'm doing. Looking good. So I'm just using a toothpick here, friends, and it's just a nice, slow, fluid, smooth movement of your hand. And I've said it before, just like we're doing cursive handwriting or calligraphy, something like that. But just a nice, even, fluid, smooth motion to your hand, and we can get some really beautiful modifications. I can just see that there's a couple of spots that I'd like to just include in with the swipe so the motion is going the same way. One just there. And maybe, no, nope, that's it. <laughs> Checking it all moves as one and going in for the first spin. Even though it's going double quick time, friends, it's really still good to see the bloom or the swipe as such actually just enlarge and increase on the canvas had to clean up the canvas there guys or the board i would have covered the kitchen in paint and that wouldn't be good so really just with two spins we've got minimal movement and it looks fantastic so i'm going to hold it up friends hopefully i can get the light to show you the beautiful shimmers of the this little piggy pigments but as always, friends, thank you so much for joining me. Please like and subscribe. Share my video if you like what you see here. And as always, happy pouring.